Well, howdy, 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 everybody. Teresa here, just me and the critters. Just been taking a break. I was sitting here cleaning up stuff. I've been doing some baking, and I thought, I kind of need to do a vlog for today. Hello. I know. I got to turn that back on. It's kind of warm in here. Whew. I've been doing some baking, like I said. Um, let's see. It is December 20th. Whew. 2017 Wednesday evening. It is 7:11, and Brad is still at work. Um, uh, you know, getting to be their busier time. Um, and I made another hat last night, but I don't have it out here, so I'll show it to you guys tomorrow. Um, and um, I didn't sleep worth a crap last night, but what's new with that? Um, I'm just gonna quit saying that because it's the same old, same old. So. I just assume that I didn't go to sleep until 5 or 6 in the morning. And then if I ever tell you any different, you'll know that it changed. Um, but I'm all right. Um, I got up. When I finally got up today, um, I uh, called Linda. Well, I talked with Brad, and then I talked with Linda, and then I talked with Angie. So it's been a good day to catch up with, with people. Um, and um, I also uh, went outside. I can't show you the painting I finished. Just a little three by three painting. It's the first tiny one I've done. And this is my little, let's see, I'm trying to get where you guys can see it a little bit better. This is just a three inch by three inch painting I've done. I haven't listed it yet. Um, you know, if you're interested, let me know and I'll tell you the price and stuff. Um, you know, because I probably won't list anything more on Etsy. I haven't even listed the last paint two paintings previously to this until after Christmas so um but it was fun to do I enjoyed doing that so yeah I went outside and did that had the dogs outside for a bit I decided not to clean house today because we cleaned house really well yesterday and like I said I would be just visiting with friends and stuff and then I decided that it was time to um uh get going on my baking this is an apple it's an, an apple coffee cake that, that I have changed up a little bit. So I want to give you guys the recipe real quick. And then, uh, so get, if you're interested in it, get out a pen and paper. Now this is for what would be either, you know, a, a big cake pan or two square ones. So you're going to need three and a half cups of diced apples. Um, let's see, two cups of sugar. A cup of oil, vanilla, um, you're going to need three eggs, and optional is um, uh, any other spices. I put in I, apple pie spice, and if you want to have either walnuts or pecans. Now, first, like always, you do all your, your wet ingredients first, then you add your sugar, then you add your flour and spices, and then you, you fold in the apple. It's going to be pretty thick, even maybe a bit crumbly. Don't worry about that. This is a very dense cake. That's why it's more of a holiday case. cake. Um, or you can do what I did, because I'm not sure that I'm giving this out to my neighbors here in the park, to some of my neighbors out here in the park. I'm not sure if any of them have a nut allergy, or if maybe they can't, they can't eat nuts very well. So, I am... Just, I just put the walnuts on the top. You see, I have a bag of walnuts right over there. Um, and uh, I just put them on top. So that way, if somebody doesn't like walnuts, they can just easily pick it off. You bake that in the oven for about an hour. You know, until you cake it done. And then it has a, a, a caramel recipe on top. But what I did is I just buy, like, the ice cream caramel or the caramel that you use for you know, that you use with apple slices, and I just do that, and that's it, and then I'll cut them into slices, I put them on, on paper plate, I put them inside a Ziploc bag, and then I put a nice bow with a tag and a Christmas card, and voila, there you go, it's not going to cost you a whole lot of money, it doesn't call for a lot of ingredients, and people know you were thinking, of them. so that's what I'm doing, because I love to bake. And I'm doing that with just a little toaster oven. So, you know, that works. Um, I've got my second batch going now. First, I did two bread loaves of it. And then I've got a 
square pig pen and a round pig pen in the toaster oven, and I'm doing those now. Um, because, see, I can't run the air conditioner while I'm doing the toaster oven. It'll overload the circuit. So, what I do is, like I said, I've got fans on and stuff. Um, what else can I tell you guys? <sighs> That's about it. Did the dishes and all that kind of stuff. Um, uh, let Missy, you know, she always loves to lick the, the bowls. And I had this thing up to the rim. Because, you know... Um, that's seven cups of apple. I used, uh, Fuji apples, what I had. I used a total of eight, um, which is probably a little bit more than the recipe called for, but I wanted to use them, and I like it to be pretty chunky and full of fruit. So, um, you know, we've got a, um, a few people in the park that we're friends with that, you know, kind of having a hard time. Um, one couple, she's been real sick. And um, I was talking with her husband the other day. He does a little bit of cleanup around the RV park and stuff. Of course, Carlton and, and, you know, with Kay and stuff. And then Davey just got laid off. So then we got the guy right next to us. Well, now there's somebody in between us. But is a father and two grown sons. But, you know, he lost his wife last year and stuff. And I'm sure they miss some little home cook, you know, so. And give them some. And then we have some other friends that, you know, we're going to just give, give some plates of a few goodies. Now, traditionally, I would bake, I love to bake holiday cookies. Now, I hate doing sugar cookies. I hate, I find them monotonous. I hate the rolling out. Now, now I've seen some of them that are like spiral stuff. I would probably do that. But I don't do that and I don't do the gingerbread shapes and stuff. But I love to make like, you know, the, the, the peanut butter with the, Hershey's Kiss in the middle, and thumbprints, and, and different stuff. Um, Brad used to make um, homemade toffee that was to die for, and caramel corn and stuff, but we don't now, because number one, we're diabetic, and two, with having just a toaster oven, I'm not going to bake. If I bake cookies now, it's, it's, it's a, like a, a bar cookies, because I can press them all down the sheet and bake them all at once. But, um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing, and I'm enjoying that. You know, you make do. You make do with what stuff. I've had a great day again. I had a great day yesterday. It's been a lot of positive stuff. Um, you know, you let go of the hurtful stuff in the past, and you just don't let it eat at you anymore. Um, what else can I tell you guys? Um, 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 um. that's about it. I was going to make homemade stroganoff tonight, but with... Doing all the cooking and everything, I probably, I think Brad said we was just going to grill hot dogs out on the, on the grill for us. Because by the time I get done doing all this baking, and I need to let it cool for a while, then I want to package it up so that, um, uh, you know, I would want to go ahead and get it packaged up tonight and get it on the plate so I can at least take it out, you know, and let it cool. Um, you know, seal it up like cool or something, but, um, yeah, that's about all that's gone on here, just, you know, I'm gonna start another hat, of course, oh, excuse me, mm, I'm starting another hat, I worked a lot on my shawl last night, too, I'm getting, making some good progress on that, and... That's about it. Tomorrow night when Brad gets home, we need to run into town real fast and do some grocery shopping. You know, our last grocery shopping before Christmas. You know, get that ham and all that kind of stuff. And then, um, uh, um, I forgot what I was going to say. Hmm. Yeah. I hope the dogs don't make too much hell when we get home at night. Because... You know, but I can't can't be helped. So, anyway, that's all we really got going on. I hope everybody there is having a great day. Everybody I was sending cards back out to, they all left the house this morning. <laughs> Elvis has left the building. And that's all that's going on. I know the family in Wyoming got their, their box of goodies. I didn't hear if anybody liked anything, but I'm not surprised. 
Hopefully they'll let me know. Um, but anyway, that's all we got going on. And um, I hope everybody's having a good night. And remember that I love you. And I do cherish your friendship so much. And I will talk to you later. Bye.